Hello everyone, I'm happy to be here. In this video, I'm going to share with you a script that I have made for creating a cut rolling object. In this case, this guy, an old man, is cut rolling. <coughs> sorry, walking around uh, some waypoints. The waypoints I mean is this uh, formation of cubes. This old man is walking to this cube, then to this cube, and then he will walk toward the first cube. I call it a trolling system, and it is very simple. And the script is this one. I will show you. Uh, yeah, this is the character. It has this script walk patrol and it has rigid body capsule collider and the waypoints are this uh, game object it has four cubes and each cube has this tag walk with WP and it has box collider set as trigger and if you run the game, as you can see here, this guy is walking to any of these cubes. He will go here, and then he will go here, 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 and so on, in loop. And this script has an option to make the game object to be uh, to always working in loop or not if you uncheck this checkbox the character will stop at the end of the waypoint okay, let's see he will stop here because I uncheck this <coughs> checkbox I don't know if he will stop or not because it is, the game is already running and yeah it is stopping okay guys I will show you the script the script the script is here in my blog I will share the link to this blog post you can find it in the description of this video and here in this video I'm going to show you how to set up everything here uh, yeah I will I will start with an empty scene uh, I will create a scene empty scene let me see okay let me just add some a 3d plane here plane I scale it up to add mm, some material to it let me go to texture images to texture texture just to make it easy to see <laughs> This is a character. I downloaded from Mixamo. It has a rig. It is rigged. Rigged. I'm going to move it here. And it doesn't have any anything here inside this. Oh, sorry. I should move this one. This game object is pure um, FPX file from Mixamo. It doesn't have anything except this uh, animator. Let me animate this scene to see is it working or not. No, not working. Just forget it. Forget about the animation. 
I already had another video about how to play an animation you have downloaded from Mixamo. I already had a video tutorial about it. You can check out my channel. Here I'm all I will only show you how to use this script. Okay. This script work patrol CS that you will get it from my blog. You just copy and paste the script, right? First, you need to create a script with this name, Walk Patrol. I already have it here, so I cannot make it again. Scripts Walk Patrol. So when you have this script, if you create it from beginning, you need to create this script file, open it, and copy this script and paste it in your code editor. Now let's assume that you have the script already <coughs> ah, sorry guys you need to add some th things here to the character first thing is obviously the script work patrol script all right you have the script you need uh, capsule collider let's edit the collider make it this way And then you need the uh, rigid body. Rigid body, you need to freeze the rotations. All three, you need to freeze them. You have the script, the capsule collider, rigid body. Now you need one more thing, which is the waypoint. Create an empty game object here, and then create a cube inside it. Place it here. This is our first cube which is the waypoint our first waypoint <coughs> this cube should be a trigger so you need to check this checkbox and you need to apply attack to it if you check the script uh, here you already have default tag here wp tag walk wp you can type anything here and then create a tag for it for example, you make another tab, log wp wp2 for example, then here you need to add a tab log wp2, you need to create a new tab. In this case, I'm just going, I'm going to use the existing tab which is this one, log, log wp, then then we need to duplicate these cubes this is our first cube I will duplicate and play, place, place it here 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 I have these cubes with this order first, second, third, fourth, fifth, sixth and so on and if you see this script you have this easy loop checkbox you can check it or uncheck it according to your need now you have your uh, waypoints you need to drag and drop this game object waypoint the parent to this uh, slot so I can drop it here you're done let me attach the camera let me place the camera here and I set it as a child of this character now I will hit the play button and let's see how is it going to move along the waypoints <coughs> You see that it is rotating automatically it will walk toward the waypoints you can set uh, <laughs> I have cough <laughs> 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 
it is not COVID. I don't think so. But don't worry, you will not get it from me. You can adjust everything here from speed, movement speed, and turning speed. If you can, if you adjust the movement speed, you can type any number. For example, five for faster movement, or even. Twenty. You see that? It is stopping here because I did not check this checkbox. Is loop. let me stop it and I'll check this checkbox to make it uh, moving in circle in loop. You can increase the speed and. You can also increase or decrease the turning speed here. By default, it has three. If you increase it to, for example, nine, it will it will turn faster, very fast. You can set it to twenty, and you can increase the speed to get to fifty, for example. Pretty crazy, right? Okay, that's all for this video. <coughs> Thank you for watching. I've been very busy developing developing my own how, how my own game, so I did not upload too much video uh, these days. So that's all for this video. Thank you for watching. Stay tuned and bye bye, guys.